Okay, we're back. Another episode of Badger Hunts. Today, I'm really excited about these boxes. We've got two Pop King Paul boxes. These are the $75 hit or miss boxes um, from, I can't remember the exact date. Uh, he did a couple of runs. Um, I think one was $75 um, and one was $45. We got both. I think we got a four coming up the... Um, the $40 to $45 ones, and two of these. And as you can see, we got two very different size boxes. Um, we've got one that definitely appears to be one pop, one that appears to be either two pops or a two pack or something. Um, and it did say one to two pops, $75 box, hit or miss, $40 minimum value. So let's hope we hit. Um, this will be a quick video today. This is what we have is these two boxes. Um, can't really battle. I guess you kind of could, but if we're going to battle, I definitely want to have the one pop box versus the multiple pop box. So we're not going to do a battle. What we will do though, is we will put them in order, um, for the pop is right. And to see how I'm, we do. I'm going to say this one's going to be at top. You'd think so, but you never know. <laughs> right. All right. With that, I'm going to dig in. I hope you guys are liking the content content that we're putting together. Uh, we're really having a good time doing it, and I hope you guys are enjoying it as well. I love seeing the views and the subscribers go up, and um, I really appreciate you guys participating and being a part of the community. With that, let's jump in. Again, I'm going to take it off here. I'm going to not look. I there does We do have two pops, not a two-pack. Okay. All right. First pop. This one is in a pop protector. Let's see if this one is in a... This one's also in a pop protector. Okay, two okay. pops, both in pop protectors. This feels like the back. Boom. Ooh. Werewolf. Uh, Werewolf is one of the Scooby-Doo villains. Ooh. And um, this is a Funko Shop exclusive. I don't know that this one has as much value as what maybe the Creeper does. Um, you can see here, this is from the new wave and you see the, um, the Scooby-Doo pops, the four villains, um, though really cool on the back here, um, don't, haven't held very much value at this point. Uh, I'm not sure about this one. I think this one may have some, but we'll certainly check it out here and let you know what we find out. Okay. You want me to do the second one or you want to do it? Yeah, you can do the second Okay. Second one. Since this is the one pop. We're going to save yes. this one for last. Could be the hit. Ooh. Okay, this one, again, pop protector. This feels like the front. Boom. Ooh, what's okay. that? Okay, this is, oh, cool. So this is Marie Levo, I think is what it's called. It's from American Horror Story. Um, and it's, I, this is from The Coven. And this one is, again, this was damaged. I don't know that I mentioned that this was damaged, but this is a damaged pop and you can see i'm not sure if you can see the crease there on the back can you kind of see it sort of if i show you it's a little bit hard to see on camera you can see it right there um this one definitely does have some damage to it but it's also a very cool pop and these american horror story pops have really ran or at least a lot of them have here's some of the ones from the um this current wave um very cool pops i love I don't know if I love this show. It's kind of a, a combo of horror and TV, um, but it's it's pretty interesting, and each season's a bit unique. So, All right. cool pop. So, the one popper. The one popper. All right. It feels like it's just in a soft protector. Okay, no stack. No stack. All right. I don't know if this is the front. I think this is the front. Not sure. Ooh, Gremlin's oh, Glow Chase. Very cool. Gremlin go Glow Chase. I will guess. I think that's a hit. I do too. Um, I don't. I don't know the value on it. In all honesty, what's the um? What years are from? Oh, uh, seventeen. Two thousand seventeen. The Madame Laveau is from two thousand fourteen. So definitely an older pop. And the Werewolf, I think, is a relatively new pop. I want to say that's from twenty nineteen. Yep. Um, do you see it? Yep, 2019. Okay, I think this is not that difficult, though I don't know about these, to be honest I with know. you. I know, I think this one might be just because it's older. I think so we're going to say this molded. one's most valuable. 
right? Yeah. We're going to say, I don't know. We're not going to take damage into consideration because this one does have a fair amount of damage damage to it. Yeah. We'll say that and that. All right. Okay. All right. Let's look up values. We're going to keep, we're going to stay here with you while we look up values. This is obviously a very quick video compared to some of our others. So we'll stay here right with you and we'll stay, save some, um, some editing time for the other member of our team. Ooh, I have 35. Werewolf. On the werewolf. Werewolf is. Uh, I have thirty-five dollars as well. All right, so thirty-five. Thirty-five, it is. Okay. All right. Marie. Forty-eight, and I was correct. This is vaulted. Marie. Knew Lev it. Lavo. Is. I see forty-two. Oh, I see forty-eight. Interesting. And that says it's matched up to pop price, right? So pop Apparently not. not. <laughs> so interesting though. This is thirty five, this is forty two, so seventy seven dollars. Yep. And it, it wasn't a hit technically yeah. either. So um still incredible value. You guys know Pop King Paul. Dude's a killer. Right, so Always good gremlins. stuff. Gremlins. So glow this chase. is Gremlins Glow Chase. I see 150. Wow. Gremlins Glow Chase, $150. That's definitely a hit. Boom. Yes. Big hit. Um, Pop King Paul, that guy never disappoints. Um, $150 on the Gremlins Glow Chase, $77 on the Miss. Um, Awesome stuff. I still always. say that's a hit. I, I definitely think. Like, yeah, in our book, exactly. that's a hit. Yeah, it's not, it's guaranteed, or it hit our value. So, yeah. how can you beat it? Certainly not, it wasn't at the $40 value, um, above the actual payment amount, including shipping. So, always awesome, Pop King Paul. If you haven't done it, check them out. I actually don't want you to check them out because it's already hard enough to get these boxes. <laughs> um, but no, you should. If, if you're into mystery boxes, you like um, unique things and, and great value, check out Pop King Paul. He's the best. That's all I got. What do you got? I think that's it. Okay, perfect. All right, don't forget, like, subscribe, comment down below, and even hit that notification bell if you really like what we're doing. Thanks so much, guys. See you later. Bye.